so last episode we met Onizuka. I appreciate everybody who was watching and was confirming that this is Spike because I know Spike, man. I know Spike when I hear him. I, I, I guess I misunderstood what they were saying, but I thought that they hired him on permanently, but I guess not. He was only part-time part still, even though they offered him permanent. But maybe I'm just stupid. You know how I get. <laughs> Yeah. I'm Dayasha, and this is Great Teacher Onizuka, episode two, baby. Yeah, daddy. I'm only doing this so that Raphael has a little bit of a harder time editing this, because why not, right? <laughs> All right, so boom. I hope you enjoy. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the bell so you don't miss out any of these videos. Check out the Patreon and the social media. All right, you ready? I'm ready. Let's do this. <laughs> Weren't you supposed to take an exam today? Don't Test? you have to take an exam to become a teacher? Yeah, right. Only if you're an amateur. Oh wait, did you though? That's right. I understand that you need to pass this exam to become a public school teacher. I told you so. <laughs> Yo, these faces. <laughs> these faces. Goodbye, beautiful female high school students. Goodbye, dangerous extracurricular classes. It was crazy. He walked into somebody's freaking house and broke down their wall. Will ya? And nothing happened. Screw it. I could never pass the exam anyway. I should just quit while I'm ahead. Don't be a quitter. It's that quitting shit I be talking about. What's that? He took the exam. It's an application for teaching positions. Uh-huh. All you gotta do is impress him at the interview. It's as simple as that. They're just people. Uh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Nobody's like that in real life, bro. Oh, man, she's hot. Huh? Mm. Is he trying to sniff her ass? Ah! Let me ask you a real legitimate question. What would you do? What would you do if you see somebody sniffing a woman's ass on a bus? What would you do? I knew, I, listen, if you're watching this video, you are obligated to comment what you would do if you saw somebody sniffing, actively just, ah, oh, fuck yeah. Somebody's, somebody's ass. What, what, like, what would you do? What would you do? I don't even know what I would do. I'd probably laugh. I would probably laugh, but listen, I'm a civilian. I'm not a gangster. I'm not a thug. I'm snitching. I'm snitching. I'm like, hey, yo, he was sniffing your butt. Dead, cold, dead, sniffing your ass. I don't care how how down bad you are. You don't just be sniffing people's asses on public transportation. <laughs> it's bad enough when they get up. You gonna sit down and, and sniff their seat, but you gonna in a crowded bus sniff somebody's asshole? Woo! You down bad if you gotta sniff somebody's butt, bro. Why I'd show you some manners if I wasn't late for work already? Asshole. <laughs> Asshole. Thank you very much. You know, you saved me. Either he or she is running the interviews. Somebody's running the interviews. We about to find out. This be destiny. This guy in his daydreaming. All right, you clowns. Who did this? Come on now. Fess up. <laughs> Mr. Onizuka. Oh, no. Oh, my God. I'm so embarrassed. <laughs> This is so stupid. I can't teacher. Bro. No matter what, I need to get hired. <laughs> Look at the <laughs> I am Mr. Uchiyama, <laughs> principal. Well, under your personal skills, very serious. Serious is misspelled. Mm. How do you misspell in Japanese? I can take on three guys at once. <laughs> I'd like to take advantage of these in my teaching career. Hmm. What? Well, even an airhead like this clown can show up at the interview. <laughs> this clown? <clears throat> like, weren't you the one sniffing asses on the bus? As far as I'm concerned, this interview is done. Thanks. It's done? Why oh, you shit. Me like that? Oh, shit. Listen here, mister. <laughs> It's almost like the look of a potential murderer. Oh shit. Oh. Oh, he hit him. <laughs> oh, he was butt sniffing bastard. I'm going to you. Excuse me. What butt sniffing bastard. Mr. Onizuka. Goodbye, thrilling time with female students after school. 
Goodbye, love affair with a female teacher at work. Oh my god, this guy. Can I have one of those high octane frappuccinos? Sure. <laughs> Damn, you don't have to emphasize the throat noises like that. Shit. Tell, huh? Just don't know why teachers are like that. Yeah. You know I can be stupid and sometimes I'm too quick to fight. It's just the way I was brought up. I can't help it. It's in my nature. Yeah, I remember my my social studies teacher. You know, if I ever do be said some shit like that, like I'm gonna end up in 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 summer care, summer school, and like I ain't gonna be anything, and all this other stuff. I'm a piece of crap. Like I remember that, and uh, I make more money than you, good sir. Unless you hit the lottery and it's st they're still alive, um, I make more money than you. So, I forget his name though. <laughs> this guy was a fucking asshole. And he had one of those little, you know, those cups um, that you put coffee in and it keeps it hot. It's like one of the metal cups or whatever. He was talking wild shit to us. Wild shit. I don't know why he was talking so much shit, but he was talking wild shit to us. So, but then he had right after had to leave the classroom. So one of my homeboys got up and was like, <sighs> like one of those nasty spits and was like <clears throat> right in it and shook it up and put it on the thing. Bro, when we watched him drink that coffee. <laughs> the funny thing is too Is he had said a joke He said a joke And took a sip And we all started dying So he thought he was wild funny But in actuality My homeboy took a nice big spit in your drink You probably didn't even know that it's, I'll never call my students trash That kind of stuff scars kids for life mm -hmm. Get out of here Yuji Yamada we're gonna kill her. What is going on? <laughs> Use your mana. We're gonna kill her. On campus. I cannot allow you to harm the vice principal. I meet Kichi Onizuka, and if you want to get to him, I'm afraid you have to go through me first. You understand what I'm saying? What a bitch. <laughs> get rid of them, Onizuka, and the job is yours. <laughs> oh, are you saying that it's my mm. fault you guys went astray? Oh, please, take some personal responsibility. You guys aren't garbage. Don't just stand there. What in the world are you waiting for? Come on! Yeah, we're definitely not helping you. Can't you hear me, Mr. Onizuka? I said get them! Oh, he fucking suplexed him? <laughs> he had the fucking wildest face, too. You, what the hell were you thinking? It's because of teachers like you that those kids are systematically squeezed out of any safe haven that they might have ever known. Mm -hmm. This is what you call education. I don't want to be a teacher. Hey, let's go, Onizuka. Fine. He got them to leave. Hey, let's go, new face. Okay, be right there. I've got someone here from Holy Forest who says that if you get to their final interview by 6 p.m., they're going to hire you. I It's Aikichi Onizuka. I've come for my interview. <clears throat> no one's here. Ah, rats. Answer me. Anyone? This place is... You mean... Wait. Welcome to Holy Forest Academy. What I want from you is exactly what you showed us the other day. That move you did. The German suplex that was wonderful. Such stamina and strength. May I sit down? Uh, sure, go ahead. I believe that you are. <clears throat> I won't let you down, ma'am. I promise, you've got my word. I can't wait to see what Akichi Onizuka will do. I'm looking forward to the new school year. I apologize for episode two. Y'all know how we do over here. I can't recreate a video and fake it for y'all. You know, because then it'll come off as acting and... I don't want to act. So, uh... Since the sound got fucked up, we put it the way it was. But in this video, you'll get the entire, the entire video. Um, when this goes to YouTube, it'll be meshed together. But hopefully, we don't have these problems any longer. And uh, hopefully, soon, I get to upgrade my computer. And we won't have to deal with that anymore. I need to be hydrated. Let me get my water. La oh, last episode, we became a full-fledged teacher after breaking millions of laws. Which they just That's what I was saying In the last episode Where I was like Bro how the fuck You just gonna have him Destroy the city In this truck And then just get a job And not get in trouble 
That shit is crazy. And they didn't give us any closure on what happened. Like, did the other truck driver get in trouble? Like, because he clearly wasn't in the driver's seat. Well, I mean, he could have switched. But, you know, I'm sure they didn't just believe him because he could have just been like, yo, like, the dude just ran inside you right there. You know, but uh, whatever, anime. <laughs> is this your new car? Yes. It's a brand new Cresta. I just had it delivered this morning. Ah, yes. Simple lines. Car. Onizuka's gonna fuck that shit up. Oh. Damn. <laughs> then why don't you get your stuff down and I'll take you to your room? I don't think I. You get to live at the school. Hey, Mr. Onizuka. Start living right here on campus. Isn't that great? Oh, well. Hey, you. Come over here. I don't, I don't. Come here, kid. I won't bite you. <laughs> Just needed some help with the other stuff. Thanks. I got a thing about people touching my pillow. You know, it's kind of one of those things. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> okay, he got a PlayStation. Back there in my new room. <laughs> no, there's got to be some kind oh, of mistake here. <laughs> what? I'd fuck with that room. I know it was too good to be true. I got boxing gloves on. Gonna hire me and provide housing, right? <laughs> What a jip. I was just looking to see what kind of games you had. Let's see. Oh, yeah, that's Wild Arms 3. Yeah, I cleared that whole game already. What? <laughs> Dude, I'm begging you. You gotta help me. How do you help in Wild Arms? Sure, no problem. Thank you so very much, Honorable Game Master. I will not allow a hoodlum to walk these halls! Word, you were sniffing assholes on the bus. Incident. He was trying to save you from those kids with weapons. Mm-hmm. At least that's the way I see it, Bud mm -hmm. Sniffer. <laughs> She's clever. He's taking over that class. I see. Oh, they must be hoodlums. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. You know, you really ought to come over and visit me sometime. <laughs> oh, and On the roof? Well, you can, Mr. Ikichi Onizuka. That face? That is like an OD stink face. Next. I will introduce the face of a hater. New teachers. Mr. Onizuka will teach social studies in middle school and homeroom classes three and four. Class three four? Oh, that's the teacher. Wow, is he talking four? about the former two four? Mm. four mm, they must be OD. No <laughs> way, something's wrong. Mrs. Sakurai told me I would be teaching only high school students. I demand an explanation, Baldy, and you better give me a good one right now. <laughs> <laughs> Baldy, ha! Huh? Baldy, ha! Huh? You're a teacher, but you don't even know what that means. What's with your blonde hair and pierced ears? The thought of someone like you reporting to me is just unacceptable. Don't be discouraged. Look, everyone makes mistakes. Oh. Wait, were you wearing earplugs? Nah, I find the earplugs have uh. a lot of headaches. He always says the same thing. <laughs> butt sniffer. <laughs> I'm still Fucking butt sniffer. About not being a high school teacher, though. Well, rumor has it that this is one of the most problematic classes in the history of this entire school. What? Most problematic class? What kind of pro- I was quiet because... I thought I heard what he said. But it sounded like he said, Hot high school girls with loose morals. This guy... This guy is fucking ridiculous. <laughs> Problems can middle school students. What the drop fuck? Anyway, painful headaches. If you take control, all right, Spike. The beginning, the rest is gonna be super easy. Are you gonna well, get smoked? See, you gotta go to my class. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Teacher, great teacher Onizuka. <laughs> GTO. <laughs> Are you guys alive? <laughs> no smoking. Huh? Teacher, please take attendance. Huh? Oh. Am I in the right class? <laughs> Tanaka? Here. Tamura? Here. Is he not looking directly at you? Damn, they don't know about the last kids that did that shit. Any better? 
Huh? Uh, well, they were kind of quiet today. It was a real letdown, actually. <laughs> Her name is Kazumi Kahara. Mm. She's in the hospital. What? What the fuck? This is a picture of her now. Oh! Even before Miss Kahara, two teachers were in charge of that class and resigned due to psychological stress. What the fuck is going on with that class? I don't know. I'd be chilling in that little room. I'm just worried where you shower at. Do you shower at the gym or Imagine something? Imagine I would be living on campus. Shit! What was I thinking? I should have invited Fuyutsuki over. <laughs> Mr. Onizuki. Yeah. You know I've never done it before. Oh. I'm the only one here in the school building. Wait a second. Who the hell was that? I'd be chilling. I'd be big chilling. Oh shit! Unless I saw that. Then I'd freak my shit out. I can't. I wonder if the I problems can't. surrounding class 3, 4 are ghosts or something. <laughs> Mr. Where you Go, all that my shit name from? is Onizuka, and I'm not scared of you at all. <laughs> Turn on the lights now, okay? Here we go now. Ready? Is he stealing panties? Hey, where do you think you're going, you freak? <laughs> One sick little monkey. <laughs> I just can't, like, I can't get it. People sniffing seats and people sniffing underwears. I don't get it. Like, what's the, what's the appeal? I'm not trying to sniff anybody's crotch. I just, <laughs> maybe I'm different. I just don't get it. Why you need to sniff that. What if they're having a bad day? Do you smell that? Does that still turn you on? What if someone walks in and sees us? We uh, come into a locker room in a school building at night. <laughs> this thing is solid snaking it up. What is he doing? Someone is here. Uh, hi. <laughs> what the hell do you think you're doing? Oh shit, Isn't that's that night vision. You pajama boy. <laughs> <laughs> you get out of here. <sighs> Ghosts. <laughs> I crack myself up sometimes. Goodbye, cruel world. Blood. On his TV? Wait a minute. Uh, it's open. I just shut that. Huh? Oh, it's his class. <laughs> <laughs> Yoshikawa, is that you? He what are you himself? doing there? I couldn't kill myself. What the fuck is on his face? <gasps> Your brain splats. It would be gross. Now, if you don't want that, just stay there. All right? Um, oh no. Ah, uh, my dear sweet Cresta, I'm so sorry. I can't drive you home tonight. Come on, buddy. Take it easy. Ah! <laughs> uh, 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 <laughs> Ouch, now that really hurt. Everything Ouch! Buddy. By the way, if you get into a fight, you should at least fight back. So he did piss himself. Did this to you? Was it someone in your class? If everyone finds out that I got beaten by a girl... A girl? Wow, that is embarrassing. Hey, that's a pretty nice looking house. Yeah, it is. So where's your room? It's that window on the third floor. Is it just Bro, I gotta sleep! in that room? Uh Teacher, <clears throat> come on! What are you waiting for? You don't want your parents to find out, do you? What an amazing collection of games. Is this all yours? Yeah, cause I got nothing else to do. Aww. I don't have any friends at all. Aww. I was just gonna borrow a couple of these games, if that's all right. <laughs> Bro, you can't this, borrow that many so games. What made you decide to be a teacher? Well, initially I started teaching cause I just wanted to help kids. Yeah, but then I realized that it might actually be kind of a fun thing to do. Really? Mm -hmm. Yoshikawa, I gotta go. You make sure you come up with a good excuse for this one, okay? <laughs> that face. No problem. <clears throat> you stole all my games, fam. Tomorrow's gonna be a lot better. You'll have a whole new game face. He's got games in his hood. Like, that shit is OD. I'd be afraid of him shit's falling out. But I guess if you didn't buy him, then... He's still standing there. I heard that teacher, Onizuka, kept a student from killing himself. This just can't be! <gasps> what? What is in his ass? Those are needles in his ass? Nigga, what the fuck is this? <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck is this? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Yo, 
Yo, and then they got him creaming and shit. Yo, what the fuck? Yo. He's gonna be fucking pissed. He's gonna be so mad when he sees that. Those kids are fucked. Whoever did that is fucked. And I can't wait to see who it is and how they're gonna get smoked. Cause that kid is fucked. They had him creaming with fucking... He was tied up on a wooden donkey. Or it looked like a llama actually. With three needles in his asshole. <laughs> what the fuck is that image, bro? That is the craziest shit I've ever seen in my life. Oh, man. Whoever drew that is fucked. Oh, man. That's great. That's great. That's fucking great. Thank you. Thank you, GTO. Wow. That was great. Um, and then we saved this kid. And landed on our backs from a high-ass building. I would have did more than, ouch. You know what I'm saying? I'd have been a lot more hurt. But, tis anime, right? It's just, it is what it is, I guess. Well, y'all let me know what y'all thought in the comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the bell so you don't miss out any of these videos. Also, let me know if you beat Wild Arms 3. Was there a Wild Arms 3? Anyway, I'll see y'all in the next one. <laughs>